Michael, go ahead and put that on this card right here. It takes more than sight to have a vision. Just go ahead and set it. <laughs> Students at Glacier Peak High in Snohomish know. Just put them on the ground. It takes heart. Here, I want to put this on top of the On the ground. There it goes. Heart. <laughs> For Brooklyn Dana to organize the school's can drive. Forget about. Oh. Okay, two sweatshirts. Cause yeah. there's two of them, right? And heart. I'm very blessed. For Ali Stenis. And I know that I'm blessed. To hit the streets of Seattle on her birthday. Santa's playing the drum. Or in lieu of gifts. It's humbling. She asks friends to give her money. You're gonna spill it. So they can buy food and hot chocolate. Would you like a hot chocolate? For those in need. Yes. Definitely. Thank you. I'm so hungry. All right, Rita. How many years have we done this? Two, three. This is probably our third. Yeah. It's just banana boxes first. <laughs> now for Brooklyn, it will take even more heart. This past two weeks, I haven't been to class in days. To fulfill it all fits. her next vision. Woo! Everything's coming together perfectly, so I'm really excited. Oh, okay. All right, good. By now, everyone in the senior class right. knows her plan, except for Allie. I feel like we should do something for her. Allie is now legally blind after a rare eye disorder gradually erased her sight. This is an amazing girl who doesn't think about her disability. <laughs> Allie! <laughs> Yet they were all caught off guard earlier this year. You ask good questions, extra credit. When teacher John Bonner really posed one goodness. question uh, to I, a group of students it. meeting over lunch. What would you do if you couldn't fail? Is what would you do if you knew you could not fail? And people were saying things like, like, oh, I want to make a million dollars. A famous movie star. Or I want a successful business. Whatever like. else. It got to Allie. All she really said was, she's just like, well, I just wish I could drive a car. Something that most of us take for granted. And we were all just kind of like, oh. You're up. That stuck with her until homecoming coronation, mm -hmm. when Allie and Brooklyn were sitting together inside the gym. And the big bright lights up above were turned off revealing rows of tiny tea lights illuminating the runway down below. She like turned to me and she's like, oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. And it kind of took me back because I was like, wait, what? And she's like, when main lights are out, I can see smaller ones. And with that. Oh, this is just, <laughs> are you the one that called these people? <laughs> you could say a light bulb went on yeah. in her head. That's when Brooklyn's like, we could do this. <laughs> Bless her heart. I feel like it's a sword. The bright idea came from a conversation with classmate Adrian Capel. If we end it here. What if they could string together thousands of Christmas lights? Because we're going to put some lights out now. Transforming the school's parking lot. She's going to drive down. Into a driving alley. Crazy stuff. For alley. We're kind of thinking airport runway here where you're flanking the road with the lights. Donations pour in faster than the cold December rain. Hi, thank you so much for coming. So they can grant Allie's wish oh, thing yes. the on the night of her 18th birthday. So this is awesome. Yeah, this is, I'm just like speechless. I'm just overwhelmed right now. So. Her father Ken tells Allie they're meeting friends for dinner. We're all waiting for you. It's going to be crazy. So everyone get ready. To win. She's here. She's here. She's here. But as she pulls into the dark parking lot, this Allie. is what she hears. Allie. Right before Brooklyn reminds her about that lunchtime meeting. <laughs> One of the questions was, what would you do if you knew you could not fail? Do you remember what you said? Yeah. Well, what are we doing here today? We are making your dream come true. Oh my God. To make it happen, How did you do the students round up a driver's ed car and instructor. I'm scared. <laughs> who will guide Allie. Say your prayers. <laughs> through the illuminated track. I can see the lights on the left good, good, good. and stay, on the right. Now. Quickly, it becomes clear their plan is working. <laughs> and in spots where light is lacking, classmates fill the gaps with handheld battery-powered candles. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. Allie's personal guiding lights. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you for <laughs> like any first time driver, she must still get acquainted with that sensitive stranger. Whoa, <laughs> the brake pedal. <laughs> but for her parents, it's all good. Never thought I'd see this. Never thought I'd see this. No. Thank you. <laughs> Allie knows it took their heart to put her dreams within sight. In Snohomish, Joe Fryer. Yeah, hug. Thank you. King 5 News. Thank you. That was great. <laughs>
Oh, this is awesome, yeah.